Hi guys, it's Granny Tanner speaking. Welcome to Manor Lords. This is part two. In the last part we started our little village and I just see we got a new family. So those six houses are all inhabited uh, now and we have an additional family that came to us. This is very good and here uh, some more houses, yeah, four of them are just being built. This is nice. Yeah, and, and our village is um, typical um, European, Central European building, I would say. And it's called an Angerdorf. So we have an Anger in the village. And the Anger is something like a central meadow. In the beginning they had um, only meadows here and they put their animals there. And sometimes they had a pond there. And later when they had the money to build a church, they rather often built their church here and other communal buildings. And that what I want to do. I want to have a church here and maybe some uh, some places for sheep here to make it typical i we can't build a pond yet uh, but we have a well there so water is here okay here we have two more houses let's just go inside and walk walk around a little bit to get a closer look here they are building. I love to watch them building. And I have seen other players, they have um, mods for this uh, third person person. And I find this very interesting, but I don't use mods yet. So therefore I have this funny guy with the red cape. Very busy. Very good. I like to watch their work. And let's run a little bit. It's still very early with our village. But I like the early beginnings of settlements. Maybe we go and visit one of those gardens. They already worked on them. Oh, and they are just in the middle of working in the gardens. This is good. Yeah, busy, busy. And next year we get the vegetables from it. Yeah, and maybe you have already seen those uh, special types of roofs that the level first houses have. This straw-like roofs. I don't uh, know the official English word. And yeah, I think in as far as I know in medieval times this was the normal cheap type of roof for the simple people, the not so rich people. And now we only see it very seldom, at least in Germany. And uh, we have those houses sometimes, th those roofs, but only in northern Germany, usually. And they are very expensive, so it's very difficult to find someone who builds it and you have to pay a lot of money to get them. So now they are more or less for the rich people or for museum houses also. So let's check our other stuff. It's very rural here. Here we have our storage. And a small marketplace. Yeah. So here they are still building. 
And okay, we have someone. No, we don't have someone in the woodcutter's lodge. Hmm. Hmm. Do I want to have some a woodcutter first, or someone in the saw pit? Maybe first the saw pit to get some planks, and but rather soon in the woodcutter's lodge. So to to start too late with the wood cutting for the firewood, it's not a good idea. And here, here we have the ox, so maybe I just hire one of our two oxes for the logging camp. And that will help, I think. And are they working? Oh, one is guiding an ox, and the other is plowing by hand in the garden. And is someone planting? No, they don't. This is not so good. So maybe I set an area. I'll first check whether they already... Ah, here we can see someone cutting the wood. Did they already plant here? No, not really. So maybe I tell them to plant in this area. And then we will check whether they do what I want them to do. So, I make this a little bit bigger. Okay. And then let's... And they should finish their... their working in the garden, so this is important. So I'm just a little bit patient. Okay, and we still have more than 50%, which is very good. And oh, we only have eight timber. Oy, 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 oy. This is really not much. And we need 20 planks for the church. No. Oh, we will get more people, I'm sure. But maybe I make it faster. Then we don't need to be so patient. And somehow the marketplace there is good because it's close to the granary and bad because the people have to go all the way over there. I'd love to make a road. Let's check. Now we can see where we could place the church. Maybe just there? Opposite to the future tavern. Then we would still have place at the right of it for the meadow. Hmm. Oh, the pasture for the sheep. And then I could make a road to the market. Let's see a little bit. I think it's okay. And so like so. And I think this road could be deleted. It is too big. Okay. And here... Maybe I... make it so that we... 
that we reach this other road. Yeah, I think this is okay. And then we have a shortcut through our Anna. I don't know whether there is an English word for the Anger. Therefore, I always call it Anger, like the Anger village, the Angerdorf. But Anger is somehow, um, yeah, it is something between a meadow and a pasture. So it is not just a natural meadow and it is not um, a pasture because a pasture is always, as I think, it's dedicated for animals always and usually has a fence around. And this anger is something, is this a defined meadow that could be used as a pasture. And usually everything that is inside this anger is used uh, for communal purposes, for uh, purposes for the whole village. So now I built some more houses, like so. Maybe. Oh, we don't have enough wood. Ooh. Oh yeah, they. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, okay. Uh, they already. Built. The soppet is so productive now. I love it, but it's a little bit too productive, especially in the beginning. So now we have the woodcutter here, and yeah, I hope we get more more timber soon, because all the timber was used by the saw pit, and now we have 50 planks. Soon we can build our church. So, but first I want to start building new houses. Five. We wait until it's six. So, hurry up, dear lumberjacks. Yeah, this is very productive, this saw pit. But that's good, before it was quite a problem. It was difficult to keep them working. And Yeah, somehow I'd love to have one more worker at the logging camp on the one hand, but at the on the other hand, I I need the builders for my future houses and the church. Maybe I will just hire one for some minutes. So now we have six timber. This is good. And then when we um, when we can start building the church. So okay. And the trade post. The trade post needs. Four, four timber, this is not so much. Maybe first I'll, I'll buy the, build the trading post and then the church. Ah, they like to use this road. This is good. Yeah, I would use this too when I would want to go shopping. So let's see what they need. Okay, this is quite nice. The, they need the church and they need clothing, so we need a tanner. Not a tanner, but a tanner. And 
maybe I should have it a little bit further outside because of the stinking. Usually you, you would have the tenor at um, at a river or a creek or so. Um, but this is too far away here. Maybe I just put it... Uh, maybe here. There we have an opening in the forest and close to the hunting camp. We have how many hides? 12 hides. And the tenna, it needs uh, four wood. Come on. First, I want the trading post to get money. I could put it here, just close to the border. Maybe this is a good idea. Maybe. Oh, and this road is blocked. Gotta smooth that beam over there. Okay. And then the next we need for the church. Okay. Yeah, yeah, we can place our church. Hmm. When I want to keep this little road to the market where it is, the church is a little bit off center because it's somehow bigger than the tavern. Hmm. Cheated him? Never. Ah, uh, I think I'll do it any properly. anyway. So. Oh, and we got more people. This is awesome. And the food. Ah, okay. Now we have food for f f uh, 14 months, which is nice. And fuel for three months. Yes, now they have to work at the woodcutter's lodge. Let's see whether they are working. Gathering, transporting. And what is peddling? Erhard, what are you doing? Peddling, oh he... Mate, mate, get your mate here. So fresh is Oh, he is working at the shop. Okay, good. This is okay. And here, yeah, I removed them from this job, sadly. And let's see what our berries are doing. Oh, it's still full. This is good. So I won't remove the worker from the forager, forager hut yet. Here we have 45 and... We have 60 berries. Well, this is good. So the berries are our main food at the moment. This reminds me on me, <laughs> on myself, because we have a um, strawberry farmer rather close by. And now it's strawberry uh, harvesting time in our region and they ha have um, self-harvesting features. So you can go there and register your, your bowls or boxes that you brought with you and then you can collect strawberries as many as you like and then you go back there and they um, they waited and you pay how um, according to the weight of the strawberries you harvested. And at the moment I go there at least twice a week and they are so delicious there. You can't imagine how good those strawberries taste when they are fresh from the field 
and you can only choose the good ones so you don't need to to collect the the ugly ones the bad ones the ones that are not ripe you can go there and choose the ones that are perfectly red and yeah in the moment it feels like strawberries are my main source of food i don't think it's absolutely true but nearly so i eat strawberries two to four times a day and yeah i'm still absolutely into them yeah, it's like with those berry farmers here. Yeah, I I would um, hire even more people there if I had them. In the hunting camp, it's okay. Not good, but okay. So we, we still need more people. Uh, maybe I speed it up and let's see how the, the planting worked. Are those already newly planted ones? Maybe. Oh, they are too big, I think. Sometimes it's hard to decide those are the here maybe they were really busy already in the beginning those foresters then maybe i should change their area oh they are still planting okay so then i let them work until they are always waiting and in winter I don't need them because they don't plant. Okay, what is with our houses? No, yeah, it's okay. And the fuel has risen to four months. Okay, so our woodcutters are doing a good job. Okay, and what's going on with our church? Oh, still a lot of work. But they are running back and forth and bringing all the stuff. This is good. Mm, the planks, they look already weathered. But it's okay, the wooden church uh, should look a little bit weathered. Okay, and what about our trading posts? Mm. They prefer to work on the church. Ah, a new family moved in. This is good. So... Come along, lad. Um, oh, now it's hard to decide. Do I want one more people at the berries? Or one more family at the woodcutter's lodge? Hmm. Let's see. Oh. Yeah, it's it's sad if they can't uh, collect all this, the berries in autumn, or in late autumn, the berries will disappear. But um, for safety reasons, the firewood is more important. Ah, now they are looking for a planting spot. So now I have to change the area. 
And maybe I go for here. Come on, laddie. Yeah, maybe we could use the winter to uh, get quite a lot of houses in this area, on the opposite side of our anger. And because then quite a lot of jobs will, uh, will not be possible. So no more berry collecting, no more foresting. That's about it already. And then we can build quite a lot. And... Yeah, I need houses with smaller lots for the... Uh, for the joiners, for example. Later I want to have cobblers and other stuff as well, but I start with the joiner because I want to have this wooden parts and they are very good for selling. Okay, here we... The church is being built. This is good. Maybe we should go there. Meat! Meat! Get your meat here! So fresh it's practically still mooing. <laughs> practically still mooing. <laughs> okay, good job people, good job. Keep on with your good work. Should be finished before winter. Then we can celebrate Christmas with our wonderful wooden church. can see those people are not hungry. We need to hoist this timber to the game. They don't look too thin and this woman even... Yeah, she is fed well, which is good. In medieval times, she would be considered successful and wealthy. And I like to keep my people fed well. With a lot of berries. Only mere seconds until it's done or a wonderful church. Oh, oh. Yes, here they have the fence. done? No, not yet. But soonish. Yeah, they are all going away. And what is with this here, people? Are they done? No, they aren't done. 
But they are making a break. Because when they are done, the fence is all around the church. Yeah, so maybe we just go outside again. It's under construction here. Yeah. And what is it missing? Oh, they still want more timber. Yeah, they need the timber for the fence, I guess. Oh, and here it's slowly. So we speed it up a little bit and what is with the timber we have s 36 timbers this is good so i want to have someone in the saw pit hmm. but yeah until this is done the church i leave two people in the working area construction but then i think i sent someone to the saw pit so hurry up people oh, oh they they need to bring four locks with the oxen yeah this has spare time. So, we need somebody who works with this one. Yeah, yeah, come on. Get this oxen to work. Hmm. Tuman is waiting. Oh, but this one is working. So let's see. We have one which is at the logging camp. Oh, usually it works at the logging camp. And okay, we have two families here. And they are all going home. And waiting. Why? Hmm. Ah, it is full. Okay, it is full. So we make it like that. We take one family out of this and send them to the saw pit. I would really love to have uh, special storage for logs because the um, logging camp stops working when it has 28 uh, logs laying around here. And I don't like this so much. I would prefer them to keep on working. Let's see, where would be a good second? Oh, we could have some woodworkers here, only temporary, because the village will be there rather soon. But to free the land, we could just make a road here and then put another logging camp there. Like so. So, and maybe without um, Forester Hut and things like that. Maybe just for the logging. And the church. Let's see. Uh, two of five they have inside. Now three of five. Speed it up. Still a little bit faster. And maybe, maybe. 
Maybe I remove the ox from the slogging camp temporary because then they have two oxen for the construction. Winter is approaching. Yeah, now the church is finished. And they got more family members. Wonderful. Now they can be very happy. Okay. Oh, we have four, four unassigned families. Yes, yes, yes. This is good. The trading post is done. And I need... What about the tenor? Where is it? Should be somewhere here. Hmm. I don't think they built it already. Or hmm. Where is it? Camp. Maybe I just maybe oh yeah we didn't have had enough timber to build it. So here we are. And then we can put someone into the trading post. And let's see we have fifty-five planks. We could just sell some planks for the beginning. And I want to keep, let's say, at least 30 planks. Yeah. And later we tried for those wooden parts. And then I'll buy a trading route for the small shields and maybe now I should buy yeah, a new ox or another garden I think at first another garden hmm and Now we give them back their orcs. We have the hitching post already. Okay, I I order another ox and then we are totally out of money, but I hope we earn some money soon. And here we have someone. This is good. Yeah, and they are collecting a lot of firewood uh, and maybe now we can see the newly planted trees maybe those are the newly berries, planted trees berries, from the beginning and he are uh, here for here those are the right ones definitely And are they working? Not really. Harvesting. Oh, they harvest the vegetables already? Yeah. This is good. So I thought it takes one year. But maybe it's once a year. This is awesome. Okay, I think that's it for this episode. I wish you a wonderful day. Thank you for watching and all the best. Till next time. Tschüss.